a top focus at this hour. Russian energy giant Gazprom has said that it will once again drastically cut gas supplies to EU countries through its main pipeline, Nord Stream 1, due to maintenance work. And this comes as fears of an acute gas crunch continues to grip Europe. Gazprom, in an official statement, said that it is halting the operation of one of the last two operating turbines in Nord Stream 1 pipeline due to some technical reasons. The gas supplies will be halted from Wednesday. It will cut the gas deliveries to 33 million cubic meters a day. The full capacity of the pipeline is more than 160 million cubic meters. And with this, the supplies through Nord Stream 1 pipeline would now drop to just 20% of its full capacity. Germany, meanwhile, has said that it is closely monitoring the situation and that there is no technical reason, as stated by Russia, that can justify this suspension of supplies. The Nord Stream 1 pipeline that pumps gas from Russia to Germany has been running well below its capacity for weeks now. It was completely shut for a 10-day maintenance break earlier this month. Although the supply was resumed after the break, the sudden halt sparked fears that Russia might be planning to close this crucial pipeline completely. Meanwhile, Ukrainian President Vladimir Zelensky has slammed Russia for this abrupt gas cuts, calling it an open gas warfare against an united Europe. Listen in. Today we saw another gas threat to Europe. Even with the Nord Stream turbine concession, Russia will not continue gas supplies to European countries, as it is contractually obligated to do. Russia does all this precisely to make it as difficult as possible for Europeans to prepare for winter. This is open gas warfare that Russia is waging against a united Europe. It's exactly how it should be perceived. This comes as EU governments ramp up efforts to implement a plan of 15% gas savings target. This is intended to avoid a winter crisis if the Kremlin turns off the taps to Europe completely. The EU's goal is to use less gas now to build storage for winter months. Today, EU energy ministers will meet in Brussels in an attempt to sign off the plans. Gazprom has cut gas supplies altogether to Bulgaria, Denmark, Finland, the Netherlands and Poland. This was over their refusal to comply with the Kremlin order to pay their bills in rubles instead of euros or dollars. Russia was a major gas supplier to EU nations till last year. However, it slashed the supplies to record levels amid the Ukraine war. EU has accused Russia of using energy as a weapon, which Moscow has time and again denied.